Do, do you um, do you think there's this battle between old guard establishment and Tea Party, those that want real, more, more significant, dramatic change, and those that are afraid that, uh-oh, we can't be seen as extreme if we want to balance the budget and have tax reform and save Social Security. Do you see that battle emerging in the Republican primary? Well, I see a lot of battles where the Republicans, uh, you know, are really losing out. Guys like Karl Rove, who's got such an agenda for himself, and I think he's a total lightweight. But, you know, honestly, a guy like Karl Rove, I look at him and I watch him, and I know he's so full of crap, and... Uh, you know, he's really, I mean, he is the one that gave us Obama. Well, you guys are fighting right now, right? No, no, it's, uh, no, I'm not fighting. I don't even, I don't know him, really. I met him once at a Steve Wynn party. I love Steve Wynn, and, and Carl was there. He probably makes some money. Who knows? But, but you know, um, I just watch what he says, and it's all about, you know, I, it's just about his own preservation. It has nothing to do with the Republican. You know, he's got his little agenda going. And I really think he said, don't forget, he gave us Obama because Bush crashed and burned so badly toward the end, and Rove, that Abraham Lincoln couldn't have won that election if he was a Republican. In other words, Abraham Lincoln running, or anybody else running against Obama, or any Democrat, could not have won the election. Just couldn't have done it. So, you know, I mean, it's, it's, I, I, I look at it, I see so many different guys, the old line Republican establishment, and they're not into victory, they're just into self-preservation. Karl Rove is one of them.